So in regards of this episode, episode four, the magical, the, the magical uh, Pibla, uh, Madoka side story, Madoka side story, season two, or basically, or basically just want to call it like, the fourth season or something like that, of the magical girls anime or something like that, or something. But uh, yeah, definitely, um, there was kind of, it, it seems to me, I really want to ask this question. Like, if the, if the magical girls were to become, you know, like, were to become, you know, like, used to their dopplers, and they go out of control, and then all of a sudden, they turn into a witch. But is there a possibility, possibly a way, if they can turn back to normal or not? So, I, I really don't know. It really, it really seems to me they may have a chance to be alive. They may not have a chance to be alive, or, or some, or, or something, or maybe they're just being consumed, being being uh, consumed, you know, about being a witch or something like that. When your time is when your time is up or something like that, and you feel that you feel that, that your power is about to go turn all black or something like that, and your 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 amulet, whatever you want to call it, or something like that, that that then like then then like all of a sudden all of a sudden yeah you you turn into a witch you know or, or I guess that what seems to seems to know about you know in in the regular in the regular episodes of uh, Madoka and the Madoka you know season one season two which I've already seen those and especially the movie and stuff like that. And, and you know, talk about the movie. I, I really want to talk about that. I really am kind of curious about what's going to happen of of the rebellion of the, not the rebellion movie or or this is probably going to be the part two of the rebellion and stuff like that. Like what's Homer is really going to do? What is what's really going to happen and stuff like that? You know, and, and basically, I also want to talk about talk about also well too because it seems to me that Madoka and Saika and Homer are looking for are looking for mommy. I don't know why Madoka is like wasting her time just by looking for looking for. Mommy, I really don't know why. I really don't know. Maybe she must have cared about mommy or something like that. Maybe she must have, but it's just there's just there's just th there's just things that maybe Madoka doesn't even know that like if they really could if they really could save mommy if if they really could. But I just look at it like this. I mean, once you're a witch, you're you're a witch. I mean, there's no going back to being human. I, I guess I really don't know. I really don't know because I'm just kind of confused. Like. Like how they're supposed to use their dopplers and, and stuff like that, and it, it's just basically it's just basically like a new second form of power that they're supposed to have, and stuff like that. It's kind of like they're losing their conscious, and it's just like their whole whole humanity of themselves. If they don't learn how to control control their powers uh, of the doppler, then yeah, they're probably going to become a witch. It's just like just like it showed here in this episode. Episode four, where Kaidi was trying to find some kind of way, she was trying to c control herself. Even with, uh, R Ronnie, uh, Ronnie, the girl, the girl with the blue hair, and she was trying to keep her friend Kaidi from turning into a witch, and and she needs control. She needs control. So to be honest with you, I really do think there is. I, I really do think Kaidi is 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 probably is for a fact that she's not going to return back to her old self. I just don't see it happening. I really don't. Uh, that's probably gonna be probably gonna be one death of of the magical girls because once they go go out of control and go berserk, yeah, definitely they're definitely they're definitely is a witch. That that that's what I'm thinking, something like that. Especially you know with uh, uh the girl with the uh the the black feathers and what that um I, I forgot her name and something like that. She's she's basically good friends. She's basically good friends with um. With the atomic key, because we have not seen her, we have not seen her in season one of episode one uh, of episode one, because her and atomic key used to usually go out, you know, and usually goes out, you know, and do, you know, do do what they they, they have to do, and, and you know, I, I still I'm still really kind of upset about this, upset about this. Why did atomic key just stop? Like just stop? Like you know, she's kind of like no, she's kind of like. She's not worried about her sister anymore. That's what really kind of irks me because I thought that I thought that the whole season one that she wants to know about her sister, but about her sister, which I can't remember her name, but or maybe she's still looking for her sister or something like that. But but also also because also also with that that Tamaki is or I say Idahara Idahara she's basically looking for um for um, for her sister's uh, best friend. She was looking for her, her sister's best friend. I mean. I don't know. I don't. I really do not know if her sister's best friend is probably a witch or probably a magical girl or something like that. Which I really don't know. I really don't know. And I, I really, I really do think 
maybe Tamaki must have gave gave up, you know, looking for her sister. It just it just seemed she's not mentioning or or maybe she is just still trying to search some clues or something like that. So, and, and you know and, and stuff. It just that's basically what it seems to me. Now from what I've have heard, I've heard this is gonna be the last the last season of the Madoka side story. I think it is. I think it is. And I, I'm not I think they're supposed to have like some kind of season two or something like that. For, for the series or, or a season two part two or something like that I I don't know I really don't know I I for what I've heard is supposed to end supposed to end sometime in December probably the last day of December or something like that probably New Year's Eve or something like that that's pretty much what I'm doing, thinking so so yeah there's a lot of unknown unknown questions I have in regards in regards of this anime and I just don't know where to start at we just don't know where where to start at. we just don't know what to say like there, there's a lot of a lot of things can could, could go wrong, you know, in this in this episode, and especially you know, especially the girl with the uh, probably the, the manuscript, which I forgot her name. I think her name is Kaini, Kaini or something like that. I can't pronounce her name. Uh, she's definitely one of my favorites right now in, in this anime. So definitely, she is really one of my favorites. But um, uh, she says she's supposed to be. She says she's part of the manuscript, but I think she also seems like she doesn't like like being a part of the manuscript or something like that. And I mean, I'm really kind of curious. Does Tom McKean knows about the? I think she does know about the manuscript and stuff like that. But and, you know, it just seems to me that the leader of the of the manuscript is just like it's, it's just like you know they're trying to save all these magical girls, you know, for the uh, for the solution of peace or something like that, defeating all these these witches. But if they're just like defeating all these witches, then why would they? Why do they have like that looks like eggs? That looks like eggs? Eggs that have witches? I mean, they could unleash it. Unleash it all at once, and and that can cause chaos and stuff like that. They could, they could, I really actually do it, or or they could make a make a set for a a finale, a finale, uh, finale of um, uh, of the last episode for uh, March March bigger, larger boss probably is going to appear. That's probably what I'm thinking. That's going to happen, but I, I don't know. We're just going to have to wait and see. But uh, yeah, I also want to mention you guys the music, the sound, the art, the animation. It looks so 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 good. I never seen Shaft really put put in a lot of hard work and heart of the in, in this in this episode. They really have worked. It, it seems to me that the the couple of years that they that the couple of years that they had basically worked worked really well for them in their favor to work on this anime. But it just looks so so awesome. I really do like it really a whole lot. I give Shaft I give Shaft really a lot of praise for what they've been doing. So, so yeah. But uh, yeah, it was that's gonna be it for for this episode. Tell me what you guys think. What, tell, tell me what you guys think. If there's something I really miss, please miss correct me or something like that, or something in the in the comments as well, or something. So yeah, all right, you guys, please be very respectful of my comments as well. Just leave your comments on what you guys think about the episode. What you guys think was good. You guys think it was bad. Really kind of curious for what you guys would say. But uh, yeah, it was. But yeah, it was. I know it's. It was. I'll see you guys later. Take care. Hope you guys have a day. Don't forget to subscribe. Please consider subscribing. Please hit the like button, give me a thumbs up. Please hit the like button, give me a thumbs up. And don't forget, don't forget, hit the notification bell also while too. And yeah, but uh, anyways, this is Unknowing, uh, Unknowing, I'll see you guys later. Take care, hope you guys have a day. Take care, God bless. Remember Jesus, I love you guys, peace be safe. And uh, take care.